Hi everyone, my name is Gina Jambruno and I am the Program Director at White Bear Center for the Arts. Today I'm going to talk you through how to access and register for a virtual class with us at WBCA. First, there are three different types of virtual classes you can take with us. The first is a live class. This is a live Zoom meeting where you'll be with fellow classmates for live instruction with your teacher. You'll be able to ask questions, share your work, and participate in real time. The second is a pre-recorded lesson. Um, this would be uh, a link to a video and you can follow along to your lesson or lecture at your own pace at any time on your own schedule. You'll be able to rewind, fast forward, pause, all of the benefits of having a video versus a live class. And third is a hybrid class, which have both live classes and pre-recorded elements. There are three different ways you can register for a class at WBCA. The first is online, and I'll talk you through how to do that shortly. Um, you can do that on our website at whitebeararts.org. You can email WBCA and someone will get back to you wbca at whitebeararts.org or you can call the front desk someone will give you a call back and you can get registered over the phone at 651-407-0597 all right let's get started the first thing you need to do if you want to take a class at wbca is decide what class you want to take you can do so by browsing our catalog, and if you don't have one of those at home, make sure to send us an email and we'll get you on the mailing list so you get one in the mail next time. Or you can always browse our classes online, um, and I really recommend checking our website regularly because we'll continue to add classes on a rolling basis throughout the quarter, and that's where you'll get up-to-date information about all of the classes and experiences and events that WBCA offers. To do this, go to our website at www.whitebeararts.org. At the top of the screen, you'll see a drop down called classes. If you click on that bar, you'll get to see all of the classes we offer. You can also look um, at classes in different categories. So if you kind of just hover over that bar, you'll see all of the different um, types of experiences that we offer. So in this case, how about I sign up for our French conversation class? So I found my French class here and I'm going to click into the class opening. Um, on this page, you'll see a little description about the class, um, the dates and times, and buttons to register for the classes. On this page, you'll also see information on how to set up a Zoom account if you do not already have one. I'll talk you through that later. Um, for now, I'm going to go through the process of registering for a class online. I found the dates that I'd like to register for, so I'm going to click the purple link that says register now. This will prompt you to our online registration database. Um, make sure to log in if you have an existing account or have any um, previous experience taking a class at White Bear Center for the Arts. If you forgot your username and password, there also is a setting to recover your information. Uh, so here you will see all of the info you will need to register for the class. So I'm going to go ahead and register. On this page, it'll also ask you to make sure you meet the age and skill level requirements for the class. Um, so if you're taking a painting class or something that is maybe a higher level, make sure that you're reading the descriptions. Um, so that you know it would be a good fit for you. And if you have questions, um, if it is a good fit, you can always reach out to us via email or over the phone. Throughout this process, you'll also have the opportunity to make an additional donation to WBCA. We are supported by our members and every bit makes a difference. So if you're able to, please consider making a donation at the time of registration. Once you are done, you'll click complete registration. At this point, your registration is complete and I'll show you how to get to your confirmation email where you can access information for your class. Once you have completed your registration for a class at White Bear Center for the Arts, you will receive a confirmation email. Zoom and YouTube links will be included in your registration confirmation email and that's how you'll access your class. 
Um, this information will be the same for every class meeting. So make sure to hold on to that email um, so you have access to that link whenever you need it. And under the tab registration summary, you're going to see the um, description of the class, the date and time. And then at the bottom, it will say virtual meeting URL. That is the link you will click to access your class. Um, so when it when the time comes to take your class, you're going to want to open up this email and you'll find the link there. If you're taking a pre-recorded lesson with us, um, it might not be available yet. So make sure to read the description about when the pre-recorded link will be released. Um, if your registration is before the release date, you won't find the link yet and the link will be sent to you as soon as it's available. If you've registered after um, the release date, the link will be included in the email in that same spot. All right, let's say it's time for you to take your live class. Um, the first step will be making sure that you have a Zoom account. Um, if you have questions on how to create a Zoom account, you can find instructions on cl the class listing on our website right here. You can click the link for instructions on how to set up a Zoom account. It is free. Um, so you just have to create an account um, and then you're going to want to return to your confirmation email to click the Zoom link and voila, you're in your class. Here are a couple tips on um, Zoom etiquette and how to get the best experience out of your Zoom class. First, you'll want to make sure that you are muted if you are not speaking. Background noise can be distracting to other students, so sometimes it's helpful if all students mute themselves unless you have a question or want to participate with your class members. So make sure you're muted unless you're interacting in your class. Um, another note would be if you're taking a class and you want the teacher to critique your painting or you have a question about some work you're completing, you can either make sure that your work is visible to your camera. Here I am working off of my laptop that has a camera at the top of the screen. Or another option would be using your phone or another camera to take a photo of your work and then email that photo to your instructor. They might get a better view of what you're working on that way. Um, so those are the two ways to share what you're working on with your teacher. When you're done with your class, simply click leave the meeting and you'll exit the class for that session. You can use the same link that was sent in your confirmation email to access this class the following week if it's a weekly class. All live Zoom classes are recorded, so if you have to miss class for any reason or can't attend the full session, you can receive a link to the recording. If that's the case, please let the front desk know um, via email or give us a call and we'll get that link to you so you can still take the class even if you can't attend one of the live sessions. If you're taking a pre-recorded class, you can access the class by clicking the link in your email. This will take you to a private YouTube page. From there, you can pause, rewind, fast forward. You can take the class at your own pace. You'll have access to that link for the remainder of the quarter. So if you're taking a class with us in the winter catalog, you'll have access to the class for December, January, February. Lastly, if you have any technical difficulties registering for a class, accessing your class, using Zoom, you can always reach out to WBCA staff. We are here to help you. You can do it by giving us a call at 651-407-0597 or via email at wbca at whitebeararts.org. Thanks for joining us.